Someone recently told me, JW, you really gotta spice your life up. You're kinda boring. I said, you know what? I got just the thing. Let's take a look at this crazy dick. Welcome back to the channel, little flexors. Thank you so much for clicking on today's video. One of these days, I'm going to remember not to wear a green shirt against a green screen background, but today, it's not that day. Before we get started, please make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, if you've seen this content before and you haven't subscribed, subscribe so that you can know when I post in the future. Let's take a look at this deck. So we are going to be utilizing Orbital with the Evomancy attack. This is a new card from Battle Styles that I frankly haven't seen other content creators use. If there are other content creators that have used Orbital, please point them my way. I I actually just haven't seen it. So this might be a YouTube first. So Evomancy for each energy attached to this Pokemon, search your deck for a stage two Pokemon, except Orbeetle, of course, and put it onto your bench, then shuffle your deck. So this is very reminiscent of old cards in the past that have done this same kind of attack, but this is legal for standard and doesn't have to utilize the fossil mechanic like some of the other ones that had this attack in the past. As well as the Evomancy, it, it says you can use it for each energy, right? So we get the ability Ability to use since it's a stage two we can use that triple acceleration energy quickly and efficiently getting out three pokemon with that triple excel so what pokemon are we going to get out well we got the Orbeetle with the Bugs Radar. This kind of plays into the uh, the, the little bit of, uh, of trickeration that we have, the little bit of control that we have with this deck. You can either go kind of the attacking route with the deck or the control route. You have that option depending on the matchup. So Bugs Radar, once during your turn, you may look at the top three cards of your opponent's deck, put them back in any order. I like getting out this Orbeetle, but I don't prioritize it. I do prioritize getting out a Hatterene with the Mind Hat ability. Once during your turn, you may use this ability. Each player discards a card from their hand. So you can force your opponent to continually get rid of resources. And it has a pretty decent attack here, Dripping Grudge. You don't have a ton of Pokemon in play, but it's a nice one energy attacker that can do some significant damage to clean up anything that your attackers can't do. So we also have Galarian Obstagoon. This is the best Pokemon for discarding your opponent's hand. So I like to get out Obstagoon, and it also has a pretty decent attack here, Knuckle Impact. During your next turn, this Pokemon can't attack, but it does 180. So that's knocking out Dedenne's and Crobats and the like. Once during your turn with that Wicked Ruler ability, you can have your opponent discard cards from their hand until they have four. So let's say they just took a knockout. They just played a supporter. They have a huge hand. You can go ahead and Wicked Ruler really punish them for having all those resources in hand. Combine that with the Hatterene, maybe two Hatterene, and all of a sudden you're going from a big hand to two cards. It's pretty cool. The main attacker of the deck, my favorite, two cannon. Loop Cannon, that's our preferred attack. Put two energy attached to this Pokemon into your hand. Now, you say, how do you power this thing up? Well, once again, we're coming back to the Triple Excel energy. If you play a Triple Excel energy onto a two cannon and use the Loop Cannon attack, you will be able to pick up that energy back to your hand before you uh, have to discard the energy on the effect of the Triple Excel. So you're gonna do 160 damage for free it's busted. Trust me, you'll see how it works in the video. So that is the list, you guys. You see the supporters and the consistency cards that I've added to just kind of maximize that turn one Orbital. All kind of help get this deck rolling. And I think it makes for a masterpiece, especially when it works. If you're looking for something to spice up your life, give this deck a try. Let's take a look at Orbeetle from a recent stream that I had, by the way, if you want to catch me on stream, twitch.tv slash flexdaddyrighteous. See you over there. Let's take a look at the gameplay. Yeah, I, we found a really cute house today. It's kind of it's kind of janky in the basement. I could show you like a... Uh, I could show you a... Oh, I mean, I'll take it, man. This looks like a great hand if we can draw into an Orbeetle. If we can draw into an Orbeetle, we are chillin'. Oh, baby. Let's go, baby. Let's go, let's go. Let's go. No Marnie, no Marnie, no Marnie, no Marnie. No Marnie, no Marnie, no Marnie, no Marnie, no Marnie, no Marnie. No Marnie, no Marnie, no Marnie, no Marnie, no Marnie. All right, Eldegoss goes back into the deck with the calm. Oh, they got the Urshifu. Maybe we needed like a Mew. Bro, we got two Canyon, bro. We got two Canyon. Insane card, bro. Insane. 
We're gonna be a okay. Gonna be a okay. All right. So there is another Remoraid, huh? Hey, don't don't think you can pull a fast one on me. I see you. Okay, the Dene comes down. Fair enough. See you over there, buddy. All right, and a gear. No dice. No energy? No energy. They're gonna put a Crobat in. I could see them getting out a Crobat. Yeah, I don't know. This feels like a lot. For not a lot of return. I don't know what's going on. They got Rapid Strike, but they also seem to have some kind of fire package. There's a fire crystal, so I don't quite know what's going to happen here. And they didn't end up... We got the filthy... Yo, we only have one Orbeetle. <gasps> That's so sad. Alright, so we go here. Rare Candy. Orbeetle. Uh, triple XL. And then let's just like... I mean, we get rid of everything, right? Get rid of the blip bug. Go ahead and research. What could happen is we could draw into things that we, yeah, like the the two canyon. Uh, let's go ahead and Evo incense and just take out. What do we want actually? We want Obstagoon, Hatterene, and like two canyons. Evo Mancy. Does that seem, does that seem reasonable? I think we get these. <sighs> I just, I kind of want to go the, I kind of want to go the two cannon. I'm just not seeing another way we can get a two cannon out. I guess we can Evo Mancy again next turn. All right, all right, we'll take this. This is more fun. This is more fun. We'll see what the opponent can do, though. Because we have uh, officially benchlocked ourselves. <laughs> we have officially benchlocked ourselves. I just, I gotta say, I feel like we're gonna need, we're gonna need a little more juice. So there is a Tower of Waters? They're doing nothing. Oh. <gasps> Hoggers, dude. Um, all right, so we Evo Incense. So now we go here. Now we go here. Now we go here. Now we go here. I obviously recognize we can't do anything with the active, but it'll be kind of funny. Let's go ahead and Mind Hat. Force them to discard. Hey, can I play tomorrow at 1 p.m.? I can. for the team challenge. Filthy team chal. You think cut Duskull for two canyon? Maybe. All right, let's <laughs> let's give him a fire crystal. <laughs> let's give him a fire crystal, man. <laughs> uh, and then two canyon, you're up. We are looking for the triple XL. I think we can win this game. I think we win this game for sure. They're doing no damage. What you doing? What you know about rolling the D? Um, let's mind hat. I'm sad we're gonna have to get rid of a two cannon, but. LOL. This is so epic. Even if we lose, it's epic. <gasps> we didn't get it. Okay. So what I'm gonna do, <laughs> I'm gonna start loading up the ore beetle, the active ore beetle. Um, ooh. One, two, three. 
Okay. Ah. Uh, hmm. I think we'll. I think we'll give him this. Let's go here. Let's take an obsti. One obsti. And then we'll be done. Dunsky Lafleur. Um. If you ever get a mirror match, then you could say two can't plays that game. That's good. I, I keep that in the uh, in the back of my mind. Yeah, for sure, for sure. All right, uh, two canyon, please. Yeah, bring up bring up your Urshifu, bud. I dare you. <laughs> I double dog dare you. All right, they do have a Remoraid. I don't like that. Oh, we could. All right, let's go ahead and mind hat. Mind hat. We also got to think about this Tower of Waters. Let's see what they got. Oh, uh, sure. We'll give them a. We'll give them an energy. This is so epic, dude. I think we take a knockout here. I think we take a knockout here. Oh, I meant to. Uh, I meant to not attach the psychic. That's fine. I meant to attach the other one. Whoops. Because then the Psychic we could use on the Orbeetle. Because we already have one in the discard? Yeah. Okay. That was uh, that was on me. Oh, they had Welder the whole time. So the energy actually was really important. That's fine. That's fine. We're chilling. We're chilling. We're chilling. We're chilling. So now they have the Quick Ball. I think they'll have to decide whether or not... Oh, they're just gonna G-Max Rapid Flow? What do they take out? They take out this? Are they really gonna go for that Orbeetle? I mean, I guess, but... Surely there's... Do they have Zigzagoon? Is that a thing? Okay. Let's put, uh, let's put that back in. I don't know. We can't ever get it out. Yeah, there's no way for us to get that out. <laughs> All right, we'll go here. Uh, let's Hatterene. I wish we had two Hatterene out. We so, so broke. And discard the two Canyon. And we'll go there. We can knock out with Knuckle Impact next turn, actually. So let's go ahead and loop. Um, loop Canyon. Pick up this and this. Because we want the Psychic back, potentially. How many Pokemon in the discard? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. This deck is good? <laughs> I think, uh, so, okay, so here's the thing. We actually need the U-turn boards to be um, air balloons. Yeah, for sure. Guaranteed air balloons needs to be that. Yeah. Needs to be that because uh, it would be nice to not have to discard energy every time we uh, retreated. Amon. So there's the Octo. They got nothing really. They can attack with the max transform, but they're going to do 180 one time. Oh, they can loop Canyon. So they're gonna knock out the Ore Beetle. I think we didn't use Ore Beetle last time. That's on me. And they're gonna knock out, they can't knock out anything. We have the goaded setup. We have the goaded setup. So we could either take a knockout on the active. I think we just gust. Right? Because we win with this thing. So let's gust this. Let's go here. Let's go mind hat. And then we can win with the... Uh, oh, oh, I should have... Uh, I should have did that in a different order, of course. Of course. I should have... Uh, Galarian obstacles. Okay, forgive me. Forgive me. 
Forgive me. I know there's there's screeching going on in the chat. We're going to win anyway, so it's fine. We're going to win anyway, so it's fine. But yeah, we could have forced our opponent to uh, to discard twice, which is ridiculous. Excuse me, discard three times. Discard twice with this ability, and then loop canyon. We'll go ahead and take both energy off. That's fine. So now if they knock out the two cannon, we win with this. I think we just have too many attackers. I think we win. I don't think we can lose. That's so epic. <laughs> oh, man. That's so epic. Hey, um, what game should I get on the Nintendo Switch? I... I have been given the green light to acquire a Nintendo Switch. And I'm wondering, I've never, um... I've never played the Switch. I do not have a... a Switch. Oh, we've done it. We've actually won. Goodness. Goodness me. Obstagoon, you filthy dog. Is it a dog or is it a weasel? You filthy weasel. The kiss weasel. Gene Simmons. I think we have a decent VMAX matchup. Oh, baby. All right, we need to get, well, you know what we need to get. All right, come on. Oh, they're playing Salamence? Oh, that's that's tough. That's tough, for sure. That's tough. Okay. Um, capture. Blip bug. Calm. That back in. Get yourself... I think nothing. <laughs> I think nothing. We could get a third blip bug, but I don't... I don't think we actually want that. Um... Go air balloon on the bench. We could have just, we could have just passed. That's fine. That's fine. We're gonna be never punished for that one. We could have. Uh, we should have kept the calm. We should have kept the calm. I. Uh, we're gonna get punished now for sure because we're gonna draw into a uh, a rare candy. But Mew is needed hundred percent. See, the thing is though, people only say Mew is needed when we play against a spread deck. We beat a uh, we beat a rapid strike Urshifu. We beat a rapid strike Urshifu. I the, I counter I counter the only uh, matchup that we've played so far that's had spread, we've won against. So I I see your argument and I counter with with uh, by saying no. Okay, we totally didn't get punished. That's so good. Woodland Strawl? Oh no, this is bad. This is very bad. This is very, very bad. Um, we have to go research first. I think... No, we have to believe in the deck. We have to believe in the deck. Let's go. Uh, let's go incense. And we can get another Orbital out. <laughs> it's so stupid. We're going to get another Orbital out. <laughs> yep. That's, that's what it's got to be. Because if they knock us out, then we need to have... We need to have Rian... Oh, we can't get Orbital out, of course. That's in the stipulation of the attack. Let's get... Uh... 
What, they can do like 240 or something? We're gonna get a two cannon. A two canyon, if you will. But the thing is about the Mew is like 20% of the time it ruins your start, right? Like there's just no, there's just no viability in playing the Mew because if you start it, you're screwed. So that's like 20% of games. Whereas I don't think you play against spread decks 20% of the time. I'm open to being off about that. I'm open to being off about that. I just, I don't think, I don't think it happens. I, like, show me the receipts on that one. You know what I'm saying? Show me the, show me the receipts. You show me the receipts on how many spread decks you play. Uh, this is actually the best for us. They're gonna go Sonic double, I think, to the active and to the two canyon. And I couldn't be more pogged. Boom, boom. Yep. Oh, okay, okay. They went to the Orbital. Orbital A. If we can get into a triple XL, man, after this Evomancy, we get a Marnie. Bless. That's huge. Triple XL, please. Alright. No dice this time. Um, but, sure, we'll get another blip bug, and then let's go Evomancy, and then, I mean, I'm just saying, I think we can win off of the, uh, off of the back of Toucanon. Let's go these, just for some spice. Okay. Oh, they attach to the bench too? <gasps> they brought up the blip bug. Not like this. All right. So we really want to body with the two cannon. We really want that. Okay. We're going to go here. We're going to go here. We get it. We get it. We get it. Um. So now the question becomes actually... Do we think that they're gonna have... This is gonna be our last chance to attack with the Orbeetle. So... Let's, um... Let's let it rip. Let's go here. Evomancy. We'll get out the... The dudes. We'll get out the dudes. Full dude squad. Full dude squad, right here. All right, we'll see what they do. I think they take a knockout on the active and then they go snipe something else, but they're in a pretty bad spot. They're in a pretty bad spot. You know, we assemble, we assemble Exodia and uh, I think you just fold. If you're, if you're a Salamence deck. No, 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 but this is, it's like a pseudo control, okay? It's not like a true control. It's like kind of control-esque, but it's not, it's not a hard control deck. Okay? It's not a hard and fast control deck. It's like a pseudo control deck. All right, Woodland, Woodland, St Woodland Stroll. They're looking for the uh, triple. Oh, baby, a triple. They get an energy attachment. Okay, okay. Their hand gets like very dangerously low at this point. They are going to switch. They're going to take a knockout on the active. Oh, that's excellent. 
That's excellent. We can really body him with Obstagoon. One Salty Sake says, JW, was there a tag team cast this week? Do you get your casts from Spotify? Because if you do, there was some mess up this week. I don't know. It was on like our, uh, it was on Sounders end. So it was a, it was a weird one. I don't know why it didn't, it didn't happen this week, but it, it was on uh, Google and et cetera, et cetera. Yeah, I do apologize about that. We've had, I had somebody else that was like, hey, Spotify's not up this week, but we definitely recorded it and it definitely got out on iTunes and pretty much every other podcasting platform, so. Oh, we wanted energy there. What did we discard? Nothing good, nothing good. Okay, so we can get rid of rare candy. Got no juice in this hand. Um, we can get rid of quick ball. That energy, I should say. Oh, we meant to. Oh. Uh, how many boss do we have left? All right, we got enough. We got enough. Yeah, we, we should have uh, saved those as fodder for the Hatterene. Let's go Mind Hat. They discard first, and then we discard the Dottler. <laughs> yeah, some unknown person literally never met them before in my life um they they were like yeah hey um check this out buddy spotify is not working sorry so i do apologize about that but i don't know what i can do i i apologize but i also can't do anything so um all right two canyon you're up I mean, we win, right? It's a shame that we got rid of the boss. We would have liked to have the boss for sure. Oh, they get the triple XL? Did they have a switch? They must have a switch. Yeah, there's the triple XL coming down. <sighs> All right, they're going to take a knockout here. So what do we give them as KO fodder? Um, it doesn't matter, actually. The two cannon is probably the best card to do that. Yeah, so they're going to... Because we want to, like, continue to limit their hand. Um, yeah, all right. So we go here. We need one turn. We need one turn. So Mind Hat. They hit the discard. It might be a funky choice for them. Might have to discard a supporter or something. Yeah, and there's a supporter. Hitting the bin. Loop Canyon. We need them to not have... Um, they have too many triple XLs left. They got two left. That's just enough. That's just enough. I think we're going to come up one attack short against Salamence. Gonna boss up the Obstagoon. That's a very curious play. They could definitely get punished for this. So we see a little Woodland Stroll. That Celebi has been insane. How many switch cards do they have? What in the world? They have played like double switch every turn? I can't freaking do that with like any other deck I play, man. What in the world? I'm pogging out of my gourd. Mind hat. I think they have to have the dub here. <sighs> they just need one more triple. Oh baby, a triple. Okay, so we need to go here. We got two boss left, so we actually are gonna make this play of the research. Because we want to have a boss in hand. There it is. Okay. Play that. Orbital. Go there. Loop Canyon. Take our prizes. And then will this make the YouTube video? Only my opponent knows. Only my opponent knows. They need either... 
Coco and an energy. Oh no, they no, they can't even do it with Coco and an energy attachment. They need the triple XL. They need the triple XL. They can't do it any other way. They, they, they can't do it any other way, dude. They need the triple XL. They got one left. How many supporters? They got a Crobat. They played all four research. And they got the Celebi. They have to have the last switch, right? Because they're just built different. They're just built different. They got the escape rope. They're gonna Marty. Ah, uh, that hurts too. That hurts too, because we don't have uh we don't have triple XL. Oh we do! We drew it! We have the win! No! 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 No, I don't wanna do it. I refuse. You had every Switch card there. You had triple XL every time. Where's the justice? Where's the justice? Where's the justice for two cannon? Oh my gosh. I hope you enjoyed that gameplay. If you did, please make sure to subscribe. We've got a lot of other videos on the channel that I know you will enjoy as well. That's all for me today, guys. Remember, good luck and also have fun.